Are you going? Mm -hmm. Are you filming? I'm filming. Go. Hey guys, we're here at Perry Farms. Uh, <laughs> see our nice farm back here? So we have our tower garden. We have it erected. And we put it out here where we think we're going to keep it. So, of course, we're in the city, subdivision, yada, 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 no room in the backyard. So what you have to do first is fill up your reservoir, which I don't know if you can see in there. I know you can't. It's full of water. But with that being said, water weighs 7.5 gallon pounds per gallon. So my lovely assistant over there <laughs> spent the extra money and got this little roll around cart. Because if you do 7.5 pound, uh, pounds per gallon, you're looking at 150 pounds there. You can't just throw it around. Well now, you can throw it around. Now there is an additional cost, but it's all right. So it tells you to fill up your reservoir. Or your, yes, so we're filled up. And then we're supposed to put, make sure you have gloves, because it says acids can eat your skin. <laughs> well, I'm gonna believe them. So it says, whoa, I didn't bring up in these. Oh, good thing I got a knife. <laughs> so and we have our next door neighbor over here watching me make a fun, <laughs> making fun of me over here. So. <laughs> It says 200 milliliters, and of course you're going to get the blind guy. So, whoa, 200 milliliters. Okay, ah! well, I'm not a chemist. It says pour it in there, take your non-metal spoon, and stir it. Just stir it around. <laughs> We're stirring. I'll let you decide how long you want to stir. So, That's so bad. we got that one stirred in. Put the lid back <laughs> on. Tom's making comments over there, so I can't hear him. I know he is. <laughs> I know he is. I know where you live. Tom. She'll share later. I know where you live, Tom. She'll <laughs> share later. <laughs> so, now. You'll be thankful I'm restraining. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hey, everybody oh, yeah. comical. So, as long as you're not going to uh, correct my punctuation, we're all good. You're speaking. <laughs> exactly, I got the grammar. So, this is part B, 200 milliliters of it also. Mix it in with the spoon. Make sure it's nice and good and mixed up. And then we come over here, you have your pH tester. You have a nice little diagram. It says put five milliliters of your water in here out of your reservoir. San Antonio. <laughs> Not supposed to drop it everywhere. Okay, worth five milliliters. Let me move this away from me. Then it says, even says right here, the directions on the back of the pH tester that comes with the tower garden. It says put five drops of the test solution. You might have to help me count this because, you know, I did graduate from Paraland. <laughs> four, five. One, two, <laughs> three, four, five. So, now, as you look, they told us it needs to be from 5.5 to 6.5, then we're good. So, it does not say how long to let it sit. It doesn't say shake it or anything. So, we're going to set it on, and that almost looks pretty. What do you think there, assistant? Looks good to me. So, we're right at 6.0, so we're in the middle. So, we're good. I'm assuming we don't throw this back in. So we're going to put it over here and make this other stuff grow. <laughs> so we're good to go on that. Now, it says to test your pump after you got your stuff in there. Well, we didn't like that way, so we tested it before. So it says to plug your pump in. 
and make sure it doesn't come out of the top. So we're plugging in. It's not coming out the top. Now it has a knob on the pump that's inside the tank, inside the reservoir, that if it's coming out too high, you have to adjust it. Hence the reason we did it before we put the solution in there. So now, put your cap on, your rain cap. Make sure it's not coming out. It's not coming out. You're good. All your cages are getting water, so they're getting water right. So, that's that. Now it says when you do the timer, it says to set it 15 minutes on, 15 minutes on, 15 minutes off, and 15 minutes on. Instead of continuous, it works better. Uh, we haven't put that on because we're going to rearrange. This is just for to show you all how easy it was to set up. Now, I think we're going to, since we're tested it good, I think we're going to open our box here and see our seedlings, which we got these. Explain these, baby. So you can either start from seed in the rock wall kit that comes with the unit or we actually bought the seedlings that are already the three inches tall and ready to go into the tower garden from um, from a place called ATL Urban Gardens. So yeah, they, they are, are already ready. They came shipped. They were here within two days. And so we're going to take these out and just put them straight into the tower garden instead of waiting the three weeks for the seeds to so, germinate. Just pull one out. Yeah, just pull one out and put it in well, so that we can show how they go. I don't know how you pull them out. <laughs> I don't want to. I'm not a farmer. <laughs> Ah, okay, have no idea what that is. So that's the rock wall that comes with your kit that you can start the seeds in, and it fits right into... Do you have any idea what that is, baby? Oh, the plant? Yeah, because oh. it depends on where... No, we'll just put it in. We, you can take them out and rearrange them as you go. So. Okay, so, so stick it in there. That's how easy and you're done. it is. And so hopefully within oh. three weeks... The teacher pulled out the diagram. Oh, nice. So it comes with a diagram. Oh. So these grow faster than in the ground. Uh, so And they're already at thanks, the Stitch. level to go into the tower. So they should be producing within three to four weeks. So we're going to go ahead and fill our tower because we've already talked about where we want things because some of the things we got purchased are vining and some of them are not. So the vining items are going to go on the bottom because they're going to get heavier and the ones with bigger leaves are going to go on the bottom. And then uh, most of the, the lettuces and herbs are going to go on the, the top part of the tower. So, so that's how easy it is. And um, we'll do another video after we put all of it together and have the timer plugged in and everything. And like I said, at Perry Farms. See y'all later. Bye. Later.